are going to present uh, our topic is uh, food companies in Malaysia, Western and Eastern countries. Uh, this is our project. Uh, so next, we will introduce our group members. Uh, okay, me myself, Sir Omar Lakshi and Sir Moza, and my name is Najib Fadir Rahman. Uh, my name is Haris Fadir Rahman. So basically, this is uh, what we are going to present: uh, introduction, company profile, product and services of the company, uh, training, benefits and rewards, standardization, internationalization, and conclusion. Okay. Introduction. Uh, okay. Basically, this is what uh, we are going to get from our presentation: uh, the culinary landscape of Malaysia, and we are going to highlight. Uh, Companies across different regions, which are uh, Western countries, uh, Eastern countries, and Malaysia. And sorry, Eastern Malaysia. Uh, and then we will discuss also the growth and success of food companies from uh, three countries, showcasing their unique offerings and global impact. Non-Western company, which is Family Mart. May I ask here if anyone here love Family Mart? Raise your hand. Same. 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 What do you like uh, in Family Mart? Huh? What do you like from Family Mart? Most of them. Most of most of them. Like Oden, Onigiri, Ramen, right? Yes. Okay. So Family Mart is a uh, company that is a Japanese convenience store franchise chain. And um, Max Income Sri Mahal is the master franchisee of uh, Family Mart Malaysia, which uh, Family Mart uh, Japan has already signed an agreement with uh, Max Income, uh, a company listed in the SKL uh, stock, uh, stock uh, exchange, and they have agreed upon a 20 year franchise agreement that ends in 2036. Uh, it might be said that uh, maybe Family Mart. Uh, family Mart uh, and their um, operation in Malaysia in 2036. So that's a set a new stuff for us. Um, and then Sadie Source uh, started their operation in 1978, and Family Mart name was established in uh, 1981. There are now 24,000 stores worldwide in Japan, Taiwan, China, Philippines. Um, Vietnam, South Korea, Indonesia, and Malaysia. So, uh, Family Mart is a really, really big uh, convenience store, uh, one um, step behind 7-Eleven. Mm -hmm. So, uh, Family Mart's product and service description. Uh, Family Mart serves a variation of Japanese food, like what we have mentioned just now, uh, oden, ramen, onigiri, sushi, Japanese candies, and uh, many other snacks. And then they also serve uh, beverage selection like milk tea, boba milk tea, uh, also coffee selection, um, Americano latte, and many more. And they also provide uh, ATMs. Have you ever seen uh, an ATM at Family Mart before? No. 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 So it might be uh, very uh, according to the place, lah, the place that they are operated. Um, and then Family Mart sells various kind of product set food. Uh, they also sell uh, hygiene kits, magazines, stationery, toys, and CDC, and supplies. And last but not least, mobile prepaid and touch and go reload. And it's also very convenient for um, locals and tourists. Next. So as, as you can see in the picture, there are a lot, there are variation of products that we sell uh, in Family Mart. Uh, this section, we sell uh, hygiene kits, stationery, and most of the product is actually uh, food and beverages. <coughs> Next. So, family mark training approach. First, workshop among workers with supervisors. Um, annually, they might uh, handle about one or two um, centralized uh, workshops that will include uh, workers and supervisors. Uh, second, the establishment of human resources development division. So, uh, and this establishment of 
which our development division is uh, actually new because um, back then, uh, before 2019, they don't have, they didn't have the HR development division, but uh, it was established in 2019, uh, which they focus on developing um, workers' uh, skills and also training. Then, combining OJT and off-JT approach. Uh, OJT means on-site job training, which uh, they train their workers at uh, the retail store, uh, physically, and off-JT approach. Off-JT, off-site uh, job training, like they might have camp or uh, training at resort or another place outside their store. Or uh, virtual reality training, like um, two, these past two or three years, we have COVID, right? So uh, during the COVID, we train their workers using uh, VR training. So their workers can do the training uh, at home or any place that they want. Benefits of for family life staff. First, employee mature benefit association means uh, namely wellbox. Uh, it provides insurance uh, and employment uh, insurance, industrial accident compensation insurance. So, uh, this uh, initiative benefit is actually covers their well-being at workplace or at home. So, the workers can focus on their work and don't have to worry about uh, if anything happens uh, to them. Second. Benefits from financial segment. Uh, family Mart offers a retirement bonus, a defined contribution plan, and Family Mart Employee Sharing Association, also shopping coupons. So uh, these benefits cover financial segment uh, benefits for uh, Family Mart workers. And lastly, holiday entitlements, which covers 120 days annual holidays, annual pay leave, annual refreshment leave, child care leave, and five months child birth leave. Next one, localization and centralization in family mind. Uh, first one is menu, special menu adapt from local taste. Have you, you guys ever encountered, uh, have ever seen like special onigiri? Uh, nasi goreng, next. Have you ever seen this spicy kampung fried rice onigiri? Yes. Uh, so onigiri is from Japanese, uh, from Japan culture. But they localize their product uh, and combine it with local variation, which is spicy kampung fried rice. Okay, okay and products. Different country uh, we have different kind of uh, products. Like uh, most of the convenience store that operated in Malaysia, they will have uh, their product from their vendors, local vendors, like uh, gardenia like um, farm fresh so this, uh, these are the local products that um, they put in their stores so um, different country will have different products and lastly halal versus non halal so um, like in Malaysia have you ever noticed that most of uh, family mart stores they don't sell any alcohol alcoholic beverage right so because they have the uh, halal certificate which uh, deny them to sell um, alcoholic beverages in their store. So, but it will be different in different countries, lah. Uh, and then uh, standardization. The first one is uniform codes. Uh, as you can see, uh, these are uh, family mark in Japanese, family mark workers in Japan, in Japan, and these are family mark workers in Malaysia. So they have. The same kind of uniform, so this is kind of the standardization that family might apply. Uh, uh, and menu. Um, may I ask, what is the most popular menu uh, product in family mart? Or then mochi puff. Mochi puff. Uh, condor. So um, I, I want to highlight uh, or then in every country, in all countries that family might operate. They will have the same menu, the same recipe for order. So this is the kind of uh, their icon, uh, iconic me menu is the uh, standardization that they apply. And the last one is team color. They have the same color, green, blue, uh, blue and white for uh, all stores operators. Then we pass to uh, Syed from Malaysia.
welcoming the policy of McDonald's in taking care of their workers. So, uh, these are next one. These are all the benefits provided by McDonald's to the workers. If you're working in McDonald's, you can you get all of this, even more than this. Okay, so first is salary, paid leave, business coverage. If you wear spectacles, then the insurance, life insurance, vacation leave, retirement, employee income. Yeah. 
also go to Ajinari, they will enter the Ajinari and they have a coach. And the Ajinari will become a coach and then they will train the trainee to go to produce the production. Okay. So the, uh, the different Any inconvenience? 